Hello and welcome back. I'm gonna just real quick re-enter this dungeon. Yeah, just to set a checkpoint. Um, I think that that's a good idea because we're actually not out of the woods here, no pun intended. Um, I would like to find my way home. I actually like straight up don't know where I am. Um, we've kind of like fully explored this side of the world. I love the music right now. Oh my god. So what do we got here? East is Winter Shoal. Well, we might as well visit it. I'm sure we'll get a uh, point of devotion for our trouble. Now, the problem is... Oh, 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 oh god. And we don't have any mana. Um, This could spell our end. Always oh, broken. I'm trying to do enough damage that I could potentially do a puppeteer. Okay. Let's puppet this guy and then have them fight each other. All right. Got him killed by the wolf. That, that spell is like actually maybe overpowered. It's, I, I don't say that often because I, I really don't like, I like it when, you know, I find something that is actually very useful. You know, that's really all that means. Um, and I, I kind of really don't like it when a game gets like arbitrarily more difficult is made to be more challenging because like a player or some players found it too easy. They found the broken combo, whatever. And so that broken combo gets nerfed into oblivion and the game gets more difficult. Uh, and I just find that to be less fun. You know, sometimes it's not fun to um, have a game be so difficult that it, you can't even like beat it anymore. Like, what is the point? Um, I'd, I'd much prefer. Ah, here we go. So this is our wolf's hometown. This is good. We get more devotion with our with the wolf god. We get another one of these. I will definitely take this hurl ability. We'll throw that on eight, and that'll mean we have more um, strength. We have quite a bit more strength now. So I, I kind of like that the you know that ability is broken. It, it you know it's fun being powerful. <laughs> like good lord. Uh, let's go ahead and sell all of our chitin. Apparently the demand for it is a little bit higher here. Um, scraps of fur, the demand is okay. It doesn't really matter all that much. Oh wow, scraps of hide is like really high. Um, so that's quite a bit of money. I do know what I want to buy, by the way. I, I really want to buy um, a ranged weapon. I think that's got to be what we're what we're working towards. What is the clown's pendant? Manufactured in secret by the first leader of the Harlequins, like many magical devices, this was crafted for from parts of Sibirun artifacts. However, these particular parts were not found out in the wilds, but stolen from the city of dust. Interesting. There's some scrying stones. We have a lot of scrying stones. I really should figure out what those how those work. Um, broken miner construct is not worth very much. A, how much is a miner construct worth? Ah, it's worth 1600. So I could like sell and the demand is actually pretty good here, except the sales tax. What is the sales tax? That is like vicious sales tax there. Um, let's see what we have for weapons here. Yeah, we have a crossbow here. Um, that would be really nice. Uh, we should buy that and we have the means. So I, there's not really much reason why I shouldn't, except for the fact that we, we also have, uh, some really decent melee weapons here. This one has a stun chance, zero bleed chance, unfortunately, but bleed, we have the means to cause bleed. We don't really need to, it to be part of our, uh, weapon. However, this does magical damage, large club has a higher stun chance. Its strength required is 15, which we do have. 20% um, chance to stun. Kinda, I kinda just wanna, yeah. yeah. Um, so this is what we're gonna do is I'm going to 
equip that large club and we're gonna sell some stuff we're gonna sell um we're gonna sell uh, our cutlass and our mace and we're gonna sell a minor construct I kind of really want to sell one of these scrying stones. Present this to anyone gazing into it. I really just don't understand. I really need to like explore that. Um, I'll sell this orb of imbalance. Like, uh, I feel like if I sell stuff like that, like that might actually have some like use for a, uh, some kind of quest like I, I i actually really don't know how that is useful we don't need any more money um we will buy do i want a short bow or a crossbow short bow offers more dodge but less damage it also is a better for our movement than uh the crossbow i feel like we do we do just want to take the short bow even though it's less damage um like our movement speed is is actually dipping below 100% now. So, let's go ahead and take the short bow. And I am going to buy some arrows. Um, buy like arrow times 10. Oh, okay, we can only buy 10, so we'll buy 10. And I believe we do have some arrows already, right? Melee ranged. We have 54 arrows. We could sell our bolts. Um, standard U-bow is used by most Calderon hunters for bringing down prey that is fleet of foot. Cool. Uh, Clown's Pennant, we can wear that. What does it do for us? Current durability, madness defense. It offers madness defense. Cool. Um, do we, are we hungry right now? We are a little bit hungry. Okay. Uh, alchemy, can we make anything right now? Not really, not unless we use one of our potions. I guess we could drink our water. We could definitely look at some more or new armor. No man's hand amulet. You feel like your strikes are truer while wearing the device. Whether this improvement is magical or psychological is unknown. Physical melee multiplier it would be 1.15. Am I not already wearing that, though? Pointed cap would raise our movement to 100%. Would decrease our physical... Would increase our physical damage, interestingly. Strange hat with a peaked brim and a small feather. It fills you with a sense of fortune. What's our physical right now? 14. So it would reduce quite a lot of things. A lot of our defense, but increase our dodge by a lot. Our, our movement speed would like be insanely increased, but we'd also improve our ranged physical, which there is some validity there. But let's have a look at some of the other stores before we go spending any more money. Oh, also, did we spend our points? I think we did. Yeah. Ironmonger. What do you have? Sack of barley. Scraps of ancient metal. Interesting. Their demand is plus 24. You'll sell sack of barley. Do you only have the one? Of no nutritional use by itself, but a sa staple stock of traders throughout Caldera. Sure, I'll, I'll buy that, I guess. And I guess I'll buy your ancient metal. Well, you really don't have a lot to sell, do you? What do you have? Hedgehog meat. Wow. Amazing. So what can we learn from the priest of the uh, ancient moon or whatever? Uh, what is this place called? I don't know there needs to be a somewhere on the ui that tells us where we are greetings will wonder do you seek communion no then you are dreamless 
dreamless yes we don't get many of your kind here may i be of assistance we have little but our weapons and our pride ah very little pride these days it is a pitiful situation i little pride our duty is to point petitioners toward our relics so that they may walk the path to become the new archon but the relics protector is mad and our weapons are useless against it the steadfast hand our token from the great wolf it is a symbol of might and force held within the garden at least until the next archon claims it the garden of lorelei lorelei it is to the north but Slethen's madness makes entry impossible. The way is closed while the beast lives. So even the garden is not far. It is beyond anyone's reach. Even though it's not far, it is beyond... Uh, okay, so garden. The garden of... Oh, right, okay. Not far. Um, indeed, let me show you where the garden lies. You now know the whereabouts of Garden of Lorelei. Use M to check your map when you are ready. Okay, do you know about the Serpent's Eye? No response. Do you know about Roche? Long dead by now, surely. Um, do we have more notes we could run by this lad? Should be long dead but remains alive. Ask about Roche in Berlin. Roche is believed to have been some seen somewhere in the amber on the island northwest of the Red Grove. Should really look into that. There is a beast named Slethen who lives in the forest. The steadfast hand is in the garden of Lo Lorelei. Okay, so let's steadfast hand. No response, huh? Okay. I wonder what Barrow Lynn does with our wares. They are hardly warriors. I suppose guards still need weapons, eh? Don't complain about the weather. At least ours has a little bite to it. I don't know how we can call ourselves warriors. It's a disgrace. We have a rogue guardian out in the woods. None will even attempt to take it down. I, Slethen. The stories say that Slethen cannot be harmed by another, and nobody understands the loophole. Imbeciles. If they knew their history, they would know the answer. It's obvious. Slethen lost a tooth many years ago. Cryod uh, uh, Kyr Cyrodin the smith took it and fashioned it into a weapon. Alas, the fool fell in with pirates some time ago. Okay, we pirates after weapon. It would... It would kill the beast, I am certain. Slethen may not be harmed by another, but what about Slethen himself? See? So, what about these pirates? Aye. The rumors were they tried holding up in an old cave on the coast near the Henge. Not a peep has been heard from them since. Okay, what about this coast? There's a cave down there. Bad place. Rumors of dead things lurking in the dark. Typical of uh, Cyrodin to ignore that, really. I'm too old to go gallivanting around Caldera. Nobody else seems to have the gumption to do what needs doing. I do. Find the cave. Find the tooth. Kill Slethen. Once that is done, maybe we'll be worthy of the wolf's blessing. Ha, ah, fat chance. Well, where is it? There's a cave to the southwest where the, the tooth may lie. Okay, so we have to go southwest. Might be worth having some cell swords, but uh, I think I'm good for now. Something to the north here. This isn't where the garden is, surely. What is this? Is this just the wall? What is this? Someone has carved the letters, the letter S into the wall. Wall clue, huh? Ah, the hole there, stranger. Welcome to Wintershall. If you're a city person, you might not find much to recommend it. I can't understand why you'd want to sleep with no stars above. We are known Caldera-wide for our weaponry. If you seek arms, you've come to the right place. And yet, you do not have the one arm 
for which you need the most, which is the Tooth of Slethen. Has. S, huh? This is undoubtedly important. Hmm, doesn't seem like I can do anything here. But this, this does seem important. The, the, there was a wall that had S scrolled into it, but S doesn't seem to do anything. I've bumped into like every single block to do with this S and nothing seems... I wonder if these walls have anything. There's a goose here. I wonder maybe the goose has something to say. Honk. Oh, what if we yelled S? S. You shout. Yell S. No, doesn't doesn't seem to. Uh... Well, do we have anything in our notes here? The jest. Now hidden where no book should be, the second with hunters, a word in the trees. A word in the trees. So this is the... Uh, this, this is the second clue. This is the second clue. The wor word to the jest can be broken by saying a phrase in its presence. Oh, I see. I see. So we have to we have to find a full phrase. Um and right now we've only found the second. The fourth lies near bones in a mountain retreat. I wonder if we found that clue and I don't I didn't perceive it. The fifth rests with Henry six feet underground initial Initials west south east. So that would be W S E. Wes so 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 maybe I don't know. So has and so second is is has. We could perhaps find a meaning in this. I don't know where my stupid nerd book is. Let me give me a second. All right, I've written it down in my little nerd book. Evan, maybe in the room quarter. Uh, well, clue. Someone has carved the letter S into the wall. Yeah, I don't know what that is all about. Uh, we can have a look over there. Does, does this dog have anything to say? It's a wolf, apparently. Makes sense. We're in the land of the wolf. No response. Braille. Welcome. S into the wall. So we yell S. Nothing? Okay. Didn't think so. There's a river here. I don't think the river is going to be important at all. I don't know. There's a, there's definitely some cryptic puzzles in this game, but not too cryptic. Not, not so much that I feel like I couldn't figure them out. The witches of the Red Grove understand us. We both worship nature in our own way. Can't help feeling our way is the right one, though. Guess they say the same about us. Serpent's eye. The serpent's eye. Okay. Eh, just wondering. Burr. Burr. Oh, I'm not cold. I was thinking about the hole. Nasty place. The hole? It's uh, this place in the mountains. Here. I've fought man and beast alike without fear, but that place may as well just stick a sword in your nethers and be done. Okay. New note. The hole. Um, some cave or tomb west of Wintershoal. I, I feel like I've been uh, missing out by not talking to people as much. You've been north of here? North. 
If you go far enough and hug the coast, you'll find a place with four lakes and a ruin in the middle. Hey, that sounds important. That's uh, one of the gesture clues. A ruin, huh? Far enough north? Hug the coast. Yeah, I saw some of the death gesture lot nearby too. I think it has significance to those clowns. Want me to show you where it is? Yeah. Here, not too hard to find, is it? Clowns. Oh, you know, Harrow does people. Trixie lot they are. Nothing concerning them should be taken at face value. There'll there'll be a trick getting to uh there'll there'll be a trick to getting into the place, you mark my words. Okay. Anything good here? Occultist. You have Rosetta's and Havenstones. This one is against again attuned to Moon Upon Thos. Harlequin icon clear curses oh right okay i uh, wouldn't mind having a haven stone to be honest yeah just to get out you know quickly Is there anything in here just your bed these people have no roofs and it's raining all the time what is wrong with them honestly like i kind of get it but and stop it okay so uh our next stop is we're gonna go north and hug the coast Lots of kindling here. I would love to get some kindling. We're also gonna see if we can't get some blood. Be able to spot some suitable blood. Uh, funny that we can gash with a club, but I'm not complaining. So where is our uh, kindling here? Oh, there it is. Worth it. We have uh, three right now. There's more nearby though, right? I thought there was. Yeah, there is. Uh oh, what was that? Okay, yeah, we don't we don't like that. We don't like those. We don't take those. <laughs> um, alright, so we get some get ourselves some kindling. We have five now. Almost not enough. Uh, we're halfway there okay so we're gonna follow the coast and we're looking for a place where the lakes where four lakes meet uh i guess we can't continue this way there's prey here i'm i'm, I'm looking for a deer hoping we can corner this guy Um, okay, we've actually got them in a very good position. We need to range kill them. Range, range, range. What do you mean? Oh, range. Did it. We got two more devotion with the great forest wolf. This is amazing. We got some hide from them. We also got all our arrows back. I, I love that. So what are we going to spend that on? I could start saving up for this thing. So, uh, a wolf summon is quite nice. We don't really need more strength right now. Oh, we're maddened. That's fine. I don't mind. That'll, I, I don't know if defeating these critters counts as like defeating something, but certainly we can get some blood from them. I'm pretty sure. Ugh. Amber. Oh. The door remains unpassable. You have no means to open it. Okay, interesting. Okay, well, that's not really what we're trying to find. We're trying to find... We're hugging the coast to find um, a place where four lakes meet. An inscription is scrawled in this stone. It is a single word. Strange words. Dominion. I wonder if that was one of the clues. Okay, we're no longer... We are no longer maddened. We're gonna become maddened again, though. Oh, that was the place where four lakes meet. 
Isn't that where we defeated something? Is that where we got Dominion? Uh, okay, um, we can get through this. Ow. I'm not mad, you are. Honestly, this is going to work out in our favor. Blood collected. We got some hides. Those are worth really good money. And we just made more progress towards our uh, gesture goal. Um, so I'm not sure. Okay, let's leave this for the time being. We want to go here. If this is the place I'm thinking of. Okay. I, I, we did come here. I don't remember what we found, though. I can't remember what was written on that wall. Dominion. Okay, so that was the word. That was the word that we found here. Okay, so let me write this down. This is the this is the place where the four lakes meet. Um, if we look at the gist, get my nerd book here. Uh, hunters with a word in the trees. Third is the ruins with a small. Okay, so this is the third has dominion has dominion all right so that's our third clue fourth lies near bones in a mountain retreat that one's going to be a bit trickier to find i think Um, initials west, south, east. Hmm. A word will be found. That would be left, down, right. I don't know. I don't know what that... That one makes no sense to me, but we'll get there. We'll get there. Honestly, we're making great progress on that one. Um... I'm, I'm very pleased with like the num number of those that I've, I've managed to find. Okay, that guy is spooky. Let's go ahead and throw down a moonstone. That moonstone is just like absurdly good. We're at, we're at the stage where I can like actually fight things pretty reliably without even taking damage if I play my cards right. And that feels pretty good. I like that a lot. Oh, we want we want kindling. We like kindling. Uh, I do want to check out those ruins to our west because I don't think I've checked. Uh, I've been there. And also, I believe we do make progress on a different quest by visiting ruins, like a different devotion. Um, what can we do here? Oh, yeah, we want to be, I guess, maddened. Because these guys are easy enough for us to kill. <laughs> they just broke that door open. Ow. Um, this, this, that guy is kind of hard to take on when we're maddened because we have absolutely no control right now. <clears throat> yeah. But that's okay. Please, please fight him. Please, please do what I'm asking you to do. Please. Literally do anything I'm asking you to do. Nope. Okay. He was so close to death for so long. Madness is really maddening if you get my, if you get my meaning. We haven't tried hurling our melee weapon yet. Please do not go north. Please do not go north. Please go, please go south. Uh, 
Ugh. Taking a lot of damage and we're dead. We're dead. We're actually dead. All right, maybe I need to not use madness anymore. I, I, I've been kind of taking it for granted that these are easy dungeons, but like if there's enough of these guys, then it will be hard. Cheese now. I like I can't dodge. You, the the main benefit of that spell is supposed to be that we can dodge a lot of things, but it's just not working that way at all. Uh, this uh this is a relatively easy dungeon that is being made very difficult for not really good reasons other than my own hubris. I, I have zero control right now. I, I'm pressing up constantly. I am only exclusively pressing up. It'd be kind of nice if the Sibirune artifacts could become maddened. Oh God, please. Uh. Uh, I, I, I'm kind of, I'm kind of done with this. I, I, I do not want to be maddened anymore. I'm just healing a little bit. Um, I'll pass some time. Just going to move back and forth a little bit and, uh, get, become unmaddened. It does really sound like I'm saying like Madden 2024, you know, like Madden NFL. <laughs> 2024 um it's just funny every time i say it, it's like oh yeah how close are we to getting that completed by the way uh defeat 50 enemies well we're about halfway there which isn't bad not bad at all but you know it's gonna be a while <laughs> what is that that's a in interesting artifact i haven't seen before what is that? Havenstone. Oh, wow. You can find Havenstones? If I'd known that, I might not have bought them, like, ever. That shouldn't have hit me. So they only kind of move towards you when they can't see you. Which is good to know. All right. Oh, that was close. Ow, that was dumb. I'm I'm not very good at fighting these guys without taking some kind of damage. And I can't get through there. And that's the end of the dungeon. Okay. We're just going to leave. Okay, so we did get the clue here. Uh, I actually got the clue and perceived the clue this time. Is that deer trapped would be nice to um get some more hides because they're actually worth money i feel like i could hit this guy melee but um i think i actually have goals for fighting things at ranged where is that defeat 50 enemies using only ranged weapons i should be doing more of that if i can discover every type of potion Find 25 herbs in the wild. Yeah, there's lots of things to do. And I'm making progress towards all of them, just like slowly. Let's turn sneak off. Uh, that looks like a elite wolf. Snarl. Um, what can we do here? Well, we can gash them. I always love a good oh we got some we got some blood we got some more blood heck yeah bud that was easy peasy oh that was a silver wolf wow those are uh those are quite valuable and we could um go cut through the woods here but i i feel like there is a really dangerous creature here that i don't really want to fight 
Undoubtedly, there's something over there that I want to check out, but this, uh, this could go any number of ways. I'm not super keen on any of... Oh, ow. Okay. Let's start by puppeteering this lad. Oh, I got trapped pretty hard there. And I'm stunned, and it's not good. Blood tainted, that makes sense. Um, ow, what the heck is hitting me? Something hits you with eviscerator. Uh, we're bleeding right now. I don't think I have any potions. Hmm. The exact mechanism is unknown. Counters all form of deafness in the user. Uh. Grow near mushrooms, but the truth is quite the reverse. I don't know what this stuff is good for. I should really start using some of this stuff. No, uh, sparkling golden liquid help. Okay, so let's try drinking this. How about that? Yeah, that removes all status effects. There's some kind of creature in the woods here and I don't know where it is. Aha, there you are. I'm bleeding. They're bleeding. But I am almost dead. Yeah. Ah, uh, sucks. They actually dropped something interesting. Shoot. Ah, uh, we're all the way back here. Did, did I even like... Oh, that's always the worst. Like, our last checkpoint is before we fought this. That's why I always re-entered the dungeon because then it sets another checkpoint. I really don't like re like repeating stuff. Having to, to redo a dungeon is just such a bummer. Especially this dungeon, and especially when I'm playing horribly. It's like, you know, like that's why I... I when you redo a dungeon, at least in my experience, I always play worse because it's like, I already did this. I don't want to have to do it again. Um, it's not fun for me. And so I play worse and then I have an even worse time about it. Okay, well, we're almost through the worst of this. I, I really am sick of these guys, I gotta say. You know what, let's just re-enter the dungeon this way. Pick up our haven stone. We could just haven back. There's absolutely no reason for us to be hanging out in this like weird part of the weird neck of the woods. Let's uh, let's do that actually. Can only be used in the overworld map. Okay. Why are we slowed? Haven stone, use it. Okay. So, we're back here. You know where I'd like to go? Honestly, I have not really even looked at this map. <laughs> there, We've got a, a road that goes east, I think. Ah, uh, there's the hole. So that's, that is, um, well, we don't really know what is there, to be honest. There's the Garden of Lorelei. There's the Four Lake Meat. There is something we don't know what it is. I love this map, actually. Delara. Isera. Ducera. Harrowwood's Temple of the Rapier. Issachar. Asera. I'm just wondering... Heart's Temple. Oh, yeah, we, we went there. Where is... There is an island. There's Barrow Lynn. There's Ducecar. Um, I don't know what's what what is there, but um, where is this? Where is a uh, rose something? 
there's an island that we can we zoom out oh here we go so there's a few places we haven't been we haven't been over there that seems to be something we haven't been there that's probably something the way the map moves around is actually kind of neat i don't know how to put it exactly okay so i guess if we want to progress um we ought to move forward you know something i should do though before i move on is i really ought to talk to everyone here i'm gonna do that real quick before i end the episode i'm gonna talk to anyone that i haven't basically talked to like kessia here hey stranger i'm kessia welcome to moon upon thos that's me are you here for the market or the street of the gods street of the gods that's a little way to the east watch out though the priest will talk your ear off uh moon upon thos this is a city of balance balance is important yes uh, balance is everything. Without balance, there is chaos. That's the state Caldera was in before the five moons appeared. I have no desire to return to that. Darkness, madness, despair. No thank you. You know, we have one moon per god. Everybody knows that. Oh, you're dreamless. Now I understand. We get a lot of you through here. We've come to petition. You've come to petition, of course. Well, the old Archon is getting on a bit. Good for you. You should talk to the priests about that. They are the street of the gods. Okay, yeah. That's cool. Learns a, we learned a little bit more about the world. You want to know a secret? Yeah, I do. There's a fallen tunnel in the mountains on the way to Winter Shoal. I reckon it's full of treasure. Oh, and monsters. Probably all monsters, actually. You know what? Suddenly I'm not so interested. Oh, you are interested. Well, here it's on your map. Best of luck. Full, fallen treasure. Um, that is on the way to where? Oh, there's the fallen tunnel, and it's on the way to Winter Shoal. Okay, so we'd have to go. That's eh, not too bad. There's probably some treasure there. See, I mean, it pays to talk to people. We really, I, I should have been doing this for a while. I swear the amber is getting worse, but nobody wants to hear that. True, me included. Need directions? No. Oh, there's something over here that I have not explored. Rip Larry Lapper. Half man, half dog, all idiot. Henry the Black Watch. Surrounded by friends even now. You know, uh, I seem to recall a Henry. The fifth rests with Henry, six feet underground. How does one dig? Surrounded by friends even now. Henry of the Black Watch. Albert the something or other. A terminal mumbler. Hilda lies forevermore just as she did in life. Here lies Leon. The mushroom did indeed taste funny. Frederic. Inst instead on craving his, his own headstone. <laughs> Insisted on car carving his own headstone. Funny. Well, we've got a Joker wall here that lets, gives us an extra hint that this is the Henry tombstone that we care about. But, um, you know, what do we do here? One, two, three, four, five, six. I was just wondering if maybe it literally means six feet, but I'm not seeing anything there. I don't know how one would dig. I don't think I have, like anything could try using a scrying stone the area has been revealed oh that's what that means oh look at that my heart hides behind a word made by walls in moon upon thos graveyard a word made by walls what word? Uh, wall. Word. Heart. My heart hides behind a word made by walls. Well, um, there the heart is there. That would give me more health. But. Uh, I need I guess I need to find a word made by walls. I don't know where one would find something like that. It looks like I've revealed the entire map 
not just like the local area. So the scrying stone is actually really nice. I'm glad that I finally experimented with it. Ar the Archon's heart. I guess we haven't really done anything with this. This is the place of balance. Can't go in there. Guard quarters. Is there a book here? You find a book speaking of an area beneath the city once used for storage where a heretic was imprisoned a decade or more ago. There are no more records of this individual. Interesting. Undoubtedly, there must be a way. Ooh, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't know you could break the lanterns. Oh, there's a, uh, I see a, a, a staircase over there. I'm not sure how one would get to that. One would need a, a, a key, I would imagine. Fairy, hostile bar. Uh, I was just wondering if maybe one of these guys would know where to get the key. I see another book over here, but uh, I'll, that's behind another locked door. I need a, I need a key for some of these doors. Wonder if I can break in. No, nothing is really. Oh, I can go through here. This seems kind of secrety. Okay, okay. No, I don't want to leave the area. I just want to see if there's anything cool over here. Aha! Secret door! A book on the shelf describes the methods used to harvest amber bane oil from the thrash, vicious eel-like creatures living deep in the Calderon Sea. Interesting. I can't open the door from this side. Sleep sneakily, sure. I, uh, I don't think that there'll be anyone to uh, kick me out of this bed, to be honest. Okay, so there must be a secret door on around most of those places with locked doors. I just have to find it. I'm learning things, you know, the, we're getting there. Occasionally, uh, a, a video that kind of lives in my mind forever is um, uh, this old YouTube video of this guy playing some kind of weird Mario hack. And, he's, you know, occasionally he's like, ah, I'm, I'm, I'm getting stronger. You know, I'm feeling, I'm feeling good. You know, we're getting there. We're getting stronger. It's just like, I don't know. It'll, something that'll live with me forever. Um, we are at the end of the episode. I am, I am figuring out that there's things I can open in this town. I just need to be a bit more persistent. Maybe some of these are actually inaccessible. I'm not sure, but we'll, we'll figure it out. Uh, if you are enjoying this series, oh, well, we can get through there. Then uh, definitely hit the like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. And I'll see you next time. We'll be exploring Moon Upon Thos a little bit more thoroughly now that I have things figured out a bit better. What is this? Someone has carved the letter Y into the wall. Okay, so we had an S and we have a Y. Learning things very slowly. All right, I'll see you guys next time.